Hey everyone, thanks for coming to this video because today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get a game on your TA8384 Plus. So you're going to need three things. You're going to need number one, your calculator. Number two, a calculator cord. All right, depending on the calculator you have, you may need a different one. If you have questions, put it in the comments below. And you need your computer. So once you have these three things, you can start by going on the computer and going to these three links that I have in the description. The first link that I want you guys to go to is the TI Connect link and this is basically an app for your computer to let your computer read your calculator. So you're going to go to this link and you're going to go to this download right here. And then once the download area loads, you're going to look through these and whatever language you speak, you're going to click on that one. So I speak English, so I'm going to download that right there and it's going to start downloading it. Once you open it and install it, it should end up on your desktop and it should look like this, TI Connect right here. So once you have that installed, you're going to install two more things onto your computer. All right, you're going to go back to whatever web browser you're using. I'm using Google Chrome. The next link is Mirage OS. This is basically an app on your calculator that lets you play games, all right? So you're gonna download for TA83 plus 84 plus. Let it load a little bit. And once that loads, it's going to appear on the bottom right there. Now you're just gonna leave that alone, all right? And then the last thing you need is a game, all right? You can download as many games as you want. Um, I'm just gonna download Pac-Man for purposes of this video. Okay, so I'm going to download Pac-Man right here. And the third link that I have in the description is this website. And you're going to download it for TA83 plus 84 plus when you press the game. So once you have all three things downloaded onto your computer, you're now going to connect your calculator to the computer. Alright, so you're going to take your calculator, you're going to open it and you're going to turn it on. You're going to take your cord and you're going to unravel it like mine is raveled. And you're going to plug the USB into the computer, and you're going to plug the mini USB into your calculator. And make sure your calculator is on for this process, because if it's not on, this is not going to work. Okay, so now you're going to go back to your desktop, and you're going to open up TI Connect CE. Alright, once TI Connect CE is open, you're going to press Send to TI Device right here. Okay? You're going to minimize this, and you see how it says, send to TI device, sending to nothing. You have to press select device for it to send to your calculator. So press select device, and it's going to scan the computer. There it is, TI84 plus silver edition, select. There it is. Now it says sending to TI84 plus silver edition. So now once that is set, now you can browse your computer for the two files that you downloaded. Okay? You're going to go to your downloads. Okay, so this PC downloads, and you're going to go to, um, you're going to press all files, you're going to go to file type, and you're going to press all files. Now you can see that these are all of my downloads. You're going to press, you're going to press and hold down control, and you're going to press Pac-Man and Mirrors OS, and you're going to press open. Okay, once that is set, and... It says, send, it says incompatible type, don't worry about that, that doesn't matter. As long as you're sending it to the archive, you're okay. If it's not sending to the archive, if it's sending to the RAM, click on it and press set to archive right there. And it should be sending to the archive. The reason why you want it in the archive is because the archive has more memory. And if you're sending all your programs to the RAM, you're going to run out of memory and you're not going to be able to get any game. So you need to send it to the archive. So once all of this is set, you're going to press send to device. Make sure your calculator is still on. Send to device. And it's going to load a little bit. It's actually going to load a lot because, you know, this application is a little slow. But it's transferring file one of two. Pac-Man, there it is, loading. Mirage OS, loading. And... Let it load, loading, loading, loading. It loaded, there we go, it closed, and you're all set. Now you have Mirage OS and the game that you downloaded on your calculator. Now we're going to go to the calculator. All right guys, so now we're on the calculator portion and you just need to do a few things, all right? So the first thing you need to do is you need to press apps, okay? And you see how Mirage OS is one of my applications. You're gonna scroll down and you're gonna press enter. 
and then it says Mirrors OS version 1.2 produced by whatever. Now we see how it says main, you're going to press second to open the main folder. And you see how your game is right there. And then you're going to scroll down to the game and you can press second and enter. And there it is, there's your game. So you can change the speed, so this is Pac-Man, you can change enemies, and let's start playing Pac-Man. And let's see, press enter, there it is, get ready, and go. And guess what, after all of these steps, you now have successfully installed and are playing a game on your TA8384+. So thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give this video a thumbs up. Please sub to my channel for awesome gaming updates, and please, share this video to your friends or whoever you may desire because this video is pretty epic. So thanks guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.